I've created a brand new SharePoint site and as a site owner I can change the navigation so because I'm a site owner I can see the edit button here and I can try add or remove URLs from here. A regular user with uh, just a read permissions to the site can't see that edit button. Let's try to add a new URL and I have that nice panel on the right so I can remove, move up or down, I can select that one, move URLs up or down or make them sublinks on of, of other URLs but I think I can also drag and drop so I can drop that one here and it when I save it should be working now something additional that we can see here is a plus button a nice plus icon button where we can add additional links in between I'll just one add one link here and that could be my block like that let's save it and see what happened so there is my block here and now let's edit again because there is another option here so I can say that I'd like to add a new instead of a URL a new header uh, because I might have multiple blogs and this is just one of, of the many and I can say blogs okay then I can promote that link to go under blogs so make a sibling this will go uh, under the blogs and perhaps I can add another one again my blog but let's say that that might be a Fiona's blog this time so we can make a difference between those uh, but now if I save we can see a different behavior here uh, I have a drop down and when I hover on that URL it, it is it's more like a, a mega menu style where um, I might have multiple links sorted in a two, two column layout which is kind of uh, nice but we can control even further more that layout here and we can change how these links are being displayed let me just show you from where if I click the gearbox here there is a URL of a changing the look change the look let's click it and see what is there so there is an option for navigation I can click that option and there will be a, 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 a two additional options here so I can choose between mega menu which is looking like that and if I have multiple links it will load in a mega menu fashion with loads and loads of links or I can choose between cascading and the cascading looks like that looks like a flat list it doesn't look like a mega menu anymore it looks more like a drop down so two different options to display URLs under headers but the mega menu one is the default one